Welcome to our 2014 year-end housing market update. Statistically speaking, it was a typical year for home buyer and seller activity in Metro Vancouver. Home sales and listing totals for the year both ranked as the fifth highest in the region in the last decade. There were 33,116 homes sold on our MLS in 2014. That's up 16% from 2013 and 32% from 2012. This total remains, however, below the record-breaking years seen in the middle part of the last decade. On the supply side, there were 56,066 homes listed for sale on the MLS in 2014. That's 2.4% 2 above 2013 and 4% below the 2012 levels. This total also ranks fifth among the last 10 years of activity in the region. While this activity largely created a balanced market conditions, we did experience some upward pressure on home prices over the course of the year. The benchmark prices for all residential properties in Greater Vancouver rose 5.8% over the last 12 months to $638,500. Detached homes continue to be the most sought after property type in our market. The benchmark price of a single family home increased 8% over the last 12 months while townhomes and condominiums have increased 4.5 and 3.5 percent respectively. Some of the largest home price increases in 2014 occurred in the detached home markets of Vancouver, Tawasson and North Vancouver. Remember that changes and trends in home prices will vary based on neighborhood and property type. It's important to do your homework and talk with your local realtor before making your home buying or selling decisions. For further housing and market information, go to the News and Statistics section of this website. For the Real Estate Board of Greater Vancouver, I'm Ray Harris.